Hi, welcome. Today we're going to look at bladeless wind energy. Specifically, we'll examine a company called Vortex Bladeless based in Spain, which is using a new method of generating wind energy. Now you might be thinking, who cares? Why is this relevant? Well, in order for us as humans to decrease our dependence on fossil fuels, we need to start looking at alternative sources of energy. If we want to keep the earth happy, we need to phase out fossil fuels and start looking at cleaner energy sources. As a bit of a background, in 2013, wind accounted for less than 1% of global energy sources, while fossil fuels made up over 86%. In the EU, in the past 15 years, energy from wind has grown from 2% to 15%, and over 44% of current energy developments are being made in wind energy. You can also see that wind energy in the U.S. makes up 41% of the power capacity additions in 2015, and over $14 billion is being spent on these additions annually. Now, you might be thinking, I thought wind energy was good and clean. What's the problem? Well, current operation and maintenance costs can be up to $0.05 cents per kilowatt hour, a large number considering that most electricity is sold at less than $0.10 cents per kilowatt hour. Also, wind turbines are loud. Nobody wants to hear sounds as loud as a garbage disposal if they live close to a wind farm. Finally, millions of animals are killed every year by striking and flying into the blades of current wind turbine models, and that's just unacceptable. So, let's take a look at the quantitative reasoning behind choosing Vortex bladeless turbines. Vortex generators may be 30% less efficient than traditional turbines, but twice as many can occupy the same area. This means that a wind farm made up of vortex turbines can produce 40% more power than a traditional wind farm. Also, vortex turbines weigh 80% less and their foundations can be 50% smaller. Using a lighter design and a smaller foundation means a lower cost for installation and eventually the consumers. Let's look at how this new bladeless technology affects the triple bottom line. Since these small towers create energy by oscillating from wind vortices, they can be used to power a village in India, or a house in Spain, or half a house in U.S. Essentially, any small-scale application is acceptable. Since there's no need for oil lubrication, vortex bladeless turbines are totally green in operation. Think about the bats and birds that won't die now as a result of the blades. Since wind energy as a whole creates no emissions into the atmosphere, the U.S. could essentially reduce greenhouse gas emissions by up to 30%. Finally, since the maintenance, operating, and manufacturing costs are greatly reduced when compared to traditional turbines, money is saved in many different areas. The cost of energy from these vortex turbines is also 40% lower than conventional turbines. Three big things to remember about vortex bladeless turbines are that they can fit twice the number of bladeless turbines in the same area as traditional wind turbines. These bladeless turbines operate independently of wind direction and have a greater operating time and capacity factor, since they rely on vortexes in the wind coming from any direction rather than wind affecting the blades from one direction. Finally, the ecological damage will be greatly reduced as there are no blades for, the, for birds and bats to fly into. If there are no blades, there's nothing for the animals to fly into and die. And we don't want to be killing any animals while we produce energy. Thank you so much for listening to our presentation, and we hope you learned a lot about Vortex Bladeless Turbines.